Rachel is going to be all right. The knife damaged her brachial artery, but didn't cut it. She's out of surgery, and now she's resting. Chloe, what happened? I don't, I don't know. Everything happened so fast. Do you know who Damon Merrick is? Or why he hates you? I know exactly who Damon Merrick is. Start over and tell me everything. Did you and Rachel try to contact Sarah? I'm not going to chastise or blame you, Chloe. But I need the whole story. So, I got my dealer to meet us, since he knows Sarah. Frank Bowers. Yeah, that's right. But Damon showed up with him. What did Merrick want? He asked us why we were so interested in Sarah. And what did you say? No, nothing of course. Is that how it became violent? When he found out Rachel was the DA's daughter, he, he wanted information about you. And how did he know that I'm her father? I, I don't know. Maybe he's seen her before. What happened next? Damon had a knife out. And we all could see it. But then he said something that pissed Rachel off. And she just grabbed a piece of wood and hit him. And then he stabbed her. I keep thinking that maybe I could have done something, but when he attacked her, I just froze. It's not your fault. And Frank held him off so we could get to the truck. I heard a scream, but I don't know what happened. And then we were here. I appreciate you telling me the truth. What are you going to do about Damon? Find out if he is alive. First of all, my department's been after him for some time. I was told that if Rachel had arrived only a a few minutes later, she might not have, um... Thank you, Chloe. You saved my world. It will be some time before Rachel wakes up. I promise. I'll let you know when she does. Okay. Thanks. Hey. Steph. How's Drew? Pretty good. Miss Amber just told me Rachel's going to be okay. I'm really glad. Yeah. Well, our room's just down the hall. You should come by. Okay. Sure. Definitely. Uh, 
I don't think I can sit still any longer. Might as well stretch my legs while I wait for Rachel to wake up. Sean Prescott. What's he writing to the hospital about? All right, then. Thank you. Hi. Mr. North? That's me. And you are? I'm Chloe. You here to see Drew? Yeah. How are, uh, how are things going? Oh, you know how it is. Ups and downs. Drew's hurt, of course. But there's other things going well for us. Uh, I'm moving back into my, my old apartment in two and a half hours. I don't know if you know this, but uh, Mikey's been crashing at Drew's dorm. Oh? Uh, I had a bit of trouble with work. And it's all been pretty hard. Anyway, Drew managed to scrape together enough to get me back on my feet. I'm glad things are starting to work out then. Oh no. You said you were Chloe. Mikey's mentioned you a few times now. I have a question maybe you can answer. Sh sure. Both of those boys have been acting a little, well, guilty lately. Yeah, I, I've been spending most of my time looking for work. I'm worried I, I missed something important. Do you know if anything's going on with them? You should probably ask Drew. I uh, don't really know any details. I do know that whatever it is, they did it because they wanted to help you. Thanks, Chloe. They actually have helped me out, money-wise. We're a family, you know? We deal with things together. Oh, excuse me. Hey! You made it. Oh. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. How's your knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh... I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Sorry to hear it. It's, it's all good. Hmm. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. Thanks. <laughs> just, uh, trying it out. Sometimes you've just gotta do something new. Hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. Rachel's stable. She'll probably wake up soon. How'd she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? She got stabbed in the arm by demon fucking Merrick. Seriously? It, it wasn't because of me, was it? Oh, no. Somehow, we've got our own shit with him now. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? Uh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. Don't have too much fun now. Try to keep it appropriate for the hospital. Bye, Dad. See ya, Pops. Man. 
Maybe I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's gonna be up soon. Should probably head over when I'm ready. Ooh, I want to eat that right now. Hey, sorry for losing it there. It's nice of you to come by. Yeah, no problem. Easier than you coming to me. <laughs> you know what? I'm kind of tired. Oh, oh, right, right. I'll, um, I'll leave you alone. Look at that. Wells being nice for a change. I wonder if Drew will ever play again. Drew's been in a lot of pain today. I think the football team needs thicker helmets. Yep, definitely too many concussions. That'll be an interesting read. All right, I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? Yeah? Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet. Chloe, I can't even express thank you so much. I'm sorry. I'm a wreck. I stepped out to get some air. Rachel doesn't need me crying in front of her. Your hair. I almost didn't notice it. Oh. Yeah. It's... It's not a big deal. I bet Rachel loves it. I can't imagine what I would do if we lost her. Me too. You've grown so close, haven't you? Yeah. It's weird to think we just met a few days ago. When you meet someone who changes everything, you just know. Well, hang in there, Mrs. Amber. I will. Dad? I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Rachel. It really hurts. Shh. The pain will pass. Chloe's here. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. Thanks, Dad. I'll come back in a little while.
My guardian angel. How are you? Not great. Better with you here. Rachel, I'm sorry. What? What for? You're here because of me. Because I choked back there in the junkyard. What? Shut up. You were so fierce and I, I just froze. God, I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. And and you saved my life. You saved my life. I almost lost you. I can't believe I almost- You're not getting rid of me that easy. Good. Happy that your dad's here. I mean, I'm still mad at him for everything he's done, but it felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like on Mount Hood. Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. My mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. Are you sure? She could be completely different than you imagine. I'm sure. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is, will you find her, please? You really want this, don't you? I do, Chloe. I really do. Then, of course, whatever it takes. I bet my dad has her number, maybe in his office. Our house keys just under the mat. The code is 0722. To your... Your dad's office? 0722. Yeah. My birthday. I'll find her, Rachel. And then I'll... I'll tell her how fucking cool you are. Thank you, Chloe, for everything. Uh, hey, Elliot. Hey! Wait, your hair, it's different. <sighs> yeah, yeah. 
I like it. It, uh, it, it's nice. I like your shirt, too. It, you never told me you were into cars. Guess you don't know everything about me. Uh, how have you been? Like, uh, since last night? Holy shit. The Tempest was just yesterday? Yes? Uh, so much has been happening lately. I, I actually brought Rachel here just a while ago, but it feels like forever. What? Rachel's here? What happened? Uh, she got stabbed by a psycho. Oh my god. Yeah. It was insane. Holy shit. Wait, are, are you okay? I mean, I'm probably not okay, but I can deal with that later. Are you, are you two in some kind of trouble? You can tell me if you are, you know. I won't judge. What? I don't even know what you mean. Come on. A random psycho going around stabbing people? For no reason? Well, that's what happened. Chloe. I'm seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean, you're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately, right? So what? So, obviously something is going on. I swear, man, everything's really okay. Okay. I trust you. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Anyway, see you around. Yeah. See you around, Chloe. Hello? I need to search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help me find her. <sighs> 